What's up, guys? I'm going to really quickly go over the Dash Kara HVV. Uh, it's also known as, you know, a Dash Cancel Kara HVV. It's technically a Micro Dash Cancel HVV. Neither here nor there, whatever you call it. Uh, community's been calling it the Dash Kara, so that's what I'll just stick with for consistency. The idea behind it is to have a replacement for the 6S Kara, which some people tend to struggle with, especially when it comes to doing it maybe at the end of combos to help extend their HVV. And it's just an alternative. It's easier for some, harder for others. It was actually harder for me to learn it. Uh, it's all personal preference. And we can start with 5k once again. And uh, just as a refresher, if you didn't know, if you do 5k HVV right here, uh, it will not clean hit, which is kind of a big deal for Soul. A lot of his damage tends to come from clean hit heavy vipers at the end of combos. And the fix for this is a Kara cancel. Uh, alternatively, the Dash Kara. Now, in order to Dash Kara for 5k, uh, there's two different schools of thoughts, and this applies to C uh, CS as well. But you can either 5k, and as 5k2 starts to come out, you can buffer a Dash Macro input. And then once 5k2 is done, you can really quickly go through the 623H of the HVV input. Alternatively, you can do 5k and then as 5k2 is ending you can do 6236 and then plink dash macro in h uh, it's personal preference there's no real right or wrong way to go about it however you personally can get it to come out is how you should do the technique and that's the correct way for you now just to really quickly show you an example this is the 5k buffer the dash macro and put into 623h it's the way that personally works best for me, but again, it's all personal interpretation on how you do it. There is no right or wrong way here. These are just two different techniques to get the, the technique to come out, and that's the most important part at the end of the day. How you can do it is how you should do it. And here's an example of the plink. I know the plink method is easier for some, harder for others. Again, I'll say it a million times, all personal preference. You really can't go wrong here as long as you are getting that dash cancel and you are getting the clean head HVV at the end of combos where it typically wouldn't be. And now to go over CS, which is, in my opinion, even easier to do than the 6S Kara off of CS. Uh, I think, for me personally, I prefer to 6S Kara off of 5K, but off of CS, it is so easy to do this dash cancel Kara I would recommend everyone learn it, at the very least, just for being able to do harder CS routes uh, for the Enders. So again, similar uh, proof of concept that the idea is CS HVV going straight into it will not clean hit here. And the way we remedy that is again with the Dash Cancel Kara. And same as 5k, uh, the idea is you can either do CS buffer the dash macro into 623 HVV at, after the CS is done uh, very quickly. Alternatively, you can do the plank method of CS, 6236 at the end of the CS, then you plank uh, dash macro and H, and it's all personal preference. A uh, thing to note, again, much like 6S Kara, is the timing on CS is different because of the hit stop on CS. It has about three more frames of hit stop compared to a 5K. So it's honestly incredibly lenient, just how much time you have to, uh, to, to get the dash Kara to come out. You'll notice the last clip that was just playing was an example of doing the CS buffer dash macro 623H uh, iteration just as a way to get an idea of the timings of, on the button presses and things like that. And playing over this now, as I'm sure you've noticed, is an example of the CS6236 Dash Macro H Plink version. And that's really it. That's all that there is to, uh, to the Dash Kara. It's incredibly simple, and if you're struggling with uh, 6S Karas, then definitely give this a try. Note that it only works on Dash Cancelable moves, most notably CS in 5K for Soul. You cannot uh, do it with, say, 2K, which you can do the 6S Kara with. It's incredibly hard, but it is a thing that you can do. And just like last time, here is Incentive to Learn. This is about 240 damage meterless off of a round start 6H, 
which if you play soul i'm sure you know uh, happens a lot this is incentive to learn the uh 5k dash cancel car since i gave you an incentive to learn the cs last time